Hello, y'all. How y'all doing? Um, just wanted to come on here again and talk to y'all about something right quick for a minute. Um, but let's get into a prayer. Thank you, Father God, for waking up us, waking us up, and blessing us to see a new day. Watch over us and guide us and guard us, protect us throughout this day, Father God. And um, watch over us and guide us, Father God, and order our steps. And I pray, Father God, that you come to me at this moment in time, Father God, in order to give the people absolute truth, Father God. And I pray, Father God, that you are. Uh, let the Holy Spirit come through me at this moment in time, Father God, in order to give the people absolute truth, Father God. And I thank you for listening to my prayer, Father God. Amen. No. Alright, I wanted to talk about um, two things. Well, I'm gonna say one thing right now. I don't know, it might end up in two, but I'm gonna do one. Um, right now is, with them trying to do all this, uh, um, lockdowns, things like that, did you notice that they only do these things when people are waking up? When people are waking up again, uh, uh, waking up and seeing their lives, seeing the things that they uh, they are doing. So, I mean, the whole world is waking up, and the reason why the whole world is waking up is because the Lord is coming. But not only that, that the Lord is waking them up. Okay. Um, if you don't know Jesus, you're going to know him in a little bit. Um, these things, I, um, these things I speak about is, uh, it's on different levels because they try and do all nonsense. And um, with them trying to do these things, they try to make it seem like as uh, if it's just a thing to do. It's not a thing to do. These are your life. This is these are the people' lives. These are your life, your soul. These this is the control they try to control. No more of that. No more of that. No more of that. Even now, you can't control the things of God. The reason why, because it's going to rebel against you. For God is light, and they are of darkness. You understand? So it will rebel as a magnet will rebel. Okay? Um, and they try and make it seem like is it okay? It's okay, yeah. It was just gonna have a lockdown. No. <laughs> no. For what? What is the cause? So now, excuse me. They're gonna try and when they try to come up with this 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 uh, plan, don't fall for it. Do not fall for it. It's gonna be something to try and fear and terrify people to go into lockdown. Oh, it's a pandemic or something. Like See, the the thing is, they plan was being. It's been discovered and it's been destroyed. People are lifting the mandates off of their states. Um, people are coming out of their house. People are not fearing what they want them to do. So they're trying to control you 
any type of way they want. And I'm going to tell you something. What's going to happen is, with them trying to control people, is people are going to rebel against them. I don't know how long they thought they was going to hold people down or what they think they trying to do. But when you pin a dog in the corner for so long, that dog going to eventually get, either he's going to get vicious or to a point where he's like, okay, I'm tired of this. If he come up to me again and he try to keep me in this corner, I'm going to bite him. Just like that. <laughs> he already made his mind up. I'm going to bite him because he's trying to hold me here and I don't want to be here. I'm going to bite him. You understand? This is what's going to happen. Do you hear me? For them trying to pin people down and control things, the people are going to rebel so bad that It might cause some things, okay? Because they're gonna try and do everything and anything that they can, but the people are not gonna be uh, going for it because they're gonna know. They're gonna see through their scandals. They're gonna see through their uh, nonsense. And this was their last time. This little pandemic thing. This was their last time because they kept on trying to. Oh, it's it's happening again. And it, no, it's not. It's over. It's over. It's over. It never was. It was just a, 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 a thing to try and keep you controlled. So now, it's either do or the other. And I think the people are going to do this time. Because all the nonsense that these wicked ones been trying to do over the world and the masses. You can imagine who's all behind this. It's a lot of church people who call themselves churches and pastors and preachers and leaders. These people are wicked. They're wicked. And they got a lot of uh, wickedness up under them. These wicked ones. Matter of fact, they're not people, they're demons. They've been stealing your energy. They've been stealing anointing. They've been stealing um, people's prayers, manifestations, um, things of God from them. Even people's destinies and purposes. These things have stopped. No more of that. No more of that. You will pay back everything that you owe. And plus. These things have taken a toll. For the things that are righteous of God. And the people that did the things that was right. Should have got the things that was right for them. They try and do nonsense. It's so many people tied up in these things. It's even the people that's around you. I told you, you think you live in the real world. You don't live in the real world. These are agents. Agents of darkness that's amongst you. If you would get with Jesus and you talk to God, you would know these things. These are agents of darkness. And they work to keep you down. They work to keep you from your purposes, from your gifts, your talents. They work towards you. These people walk around you every day. They're around you. And not only that, they put witchcraft under you. For you don't think so, they're doing it. For a person that's a really God, that's a child of God, they can't do it. Because that person would know them. So they can't really just come around them like talking about it. Because after a day or two or after a few hours or after a few minutes, that person would notice them. I'm like, okay, yeah. 
I see him. I have to get away from my him. I see what he's doing. And when these things come about, stay away from them. Move away from them. Like now, I have to get away so many, get away from all this nonsense that uh, most of have them, you know, they, they are against me. But I'm going to tell you something. I don't care. I don't care. You don't like me. It does not matter. I don't care because you hate me or whatever. It does not matter to me. It does not matter to me. I don't care. But I'm going to tell you one thing though. You're going to respect what the Lord is doing. Through me and everything. And the reason why is because it's not me who you fight, but it is the Lord. I've told you. So, uh, I'm looking at my time, guys. I'm sorry about that. I ain't got too much story. <laughs> but, um, they try and steal people's uh, energy, they try and steal people. Anointing. It's like I told y'all, y'all, y'all don't understand how serious these things are. You can't see these things because you think it's just a person that's just trying to, you know, get in your energy thing. No, he's trying to steal more than that. He's, he wants all of it. He wants your anointing. He wants your, he wants the, your third eye. He wants your talents. He wants your gifts. He wants, he wants it. Look, get away from around those uh, demons. And it's the same ones that claim that they are um, your friends, your family. It's the same ones that claiming that they are God. Or they love God or they like God. Pay attention to the fruit. Pay attention to the fruit. And not only that, pay attention to the Holy Spirit. And if some gut feeling telling you, like, that something's not right and something's up with that person, Sums up with that person. I don't care how much they try to shake a coat it. Sums up with that person. And this is how they come. They come as uh, agents of light. I mean, they come as uh, people of God and, and people of light. The agents of darkness under cloak of light. Supposed to be light, not light. Trust me. The fruit. And their essence, I'm going to say that, the essence of their aura, of their uh, body fragrance will give it away. If you're good, it, if you want God's children or you one that can um, just like all your life, you just been like, yeah, there's something going on here, you know, you know, you always been like that, you know, um, like, always noticing things then you would know follow your first mind follow your first mind all right so i just came on here to tell y'all about these things and they try to do these pandemic uh, uh, uh wicked lockdowns all these things right now do not go for it do not go for it it's the same thing that they try to do with the pandemic because of all these things. And not only that, I want y'all to know for the let me see. Before this, um, why you think all these uh, twin towers and I wanted to talk about this topic here right quick. I'm gonna make it real quick though. Uh, these twin towers and they start all these um, major disasters and things like this. The reason why when they start these major disasters and things like this is because someone is uh, either that went through God and got blessed. Because I told you this word is not real. Either they trying to stop that person from um they, so they cause all these um when God is doing something for someone or God is doing something through someone or something like that, they call he, this enemy calls uh distractions everywhere. He 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 does all this uh tearing down things, destroying things, so people will pay attention to that instead of what they really supposed to be paying attention to, which is uh, 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 
what that person is doing, which is, you know, and, and when he does these things, he does these things out of anger and jealousy and hate and envy and things like that, okay? So I just wanted y'all to know that when these things like this happen, it's because something is going, it's something God is doing. And that he don't like what God is doing. Alright? So I just wanted to know on that too. So when y'all get these messages, um, I pray that y'all take these messages to the Lord at this moment in time. Um, do some fasting, some praying, some um, getting in your word, communion with the Lord, build a relationship with him. Um, yeah, um, this is God's good news for you today, and y'all be blessed.